Hi beauties and curls, it's Melissa Q. Thanks so much for coming in and taking a seat. And out of all the YouTube universe, you decided to come and chit chat with your girl, yes. And planes are flying and they're so loud. And today's video is going to be a haul. Now, before we get into the haul, let me just say, if you are new, welcome. If you're an OG, thanks so much for coming back over and over again. And don't forget, don't forget, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. We would love for you to be a part of the Missy Cute family over here. I can wait. Did you hit it? We would love for you to hit the button and hit the notification bell. It's gonna let you know that I post videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 9 p.m. Eastern. And if you're in between, you know the deal. But if you are new, thank you so much for coming in. I hope this won't be your last time. And today is a haul. I am incorporating my Sephora VIB because I did not get a lot, but this is also the last haul that I am doing for the year. Now, on my vlog channel, Missy Q Memoirs, you probably will see PR unboxings all the time, but this is the last haul that you're gonna see on this channel just because I just wanna do the hauls seasonal. I don't want this to be a channel that's inundated with a lot of hauls but I also want to come back with the haul report let you guys know what I think about the items that I haul I did that a couple of years ago but I think in 2018 I'm gonna bring that back no more chit chat let's get into this haul so the first thing I got from the Sephora VIB this is the Shiseido facial cotton pads or wipes or it just says Shiseido facial cotton that's all and it, I think it's about 165. I love this. I always get this during the Sephora VIP. Once you use these, you won't go back. Okay, seriously. I've heard a couple of people talk about this. I think Jacqueline Hill really turned me on to getting this just because, you know, she was a she was a fellow makeup artist. And usually in terms of texture and consistencies, she's really good on that. And so I got these and y'all, I tried to go back. And it was okay but when the cotton started rolling off my face and everything this you don't get that and I can use one wipe to actually get off eye makeup off of both of my eyes just because it soaks in the product it doesn't break up the cotton doesn't break off and it it's worth it I feel like it's worth it ten dollars four hundred and sixty five I feel like it's worth it just because I don't have to go in and like pull it pull uh, it's just anyway this is not becoming a review. <laughs> I just wanted to tell you that I bought those. Okay, the next thing that I bought, I wanted to get things that I felt like that I needed. So this is the Agave Kisses set. I had this in my cart and it sold out, but this was the last one in the store. So I went in and got it. And by the way, I use gift cards, y'all. I may have spent $9 for this whole thing, but most of it was uh, gift cards. This is the Bite Beauty Agave set. So it comes with the scrub, the mask, and a lip balm. Now I've tried the lip balm and it's okay. Um, I love this. I've used this before. And this is $26, I think, by itself in a larger form. And a little bit goes a long way. So I feel like that this for $20 was worth it. So I got this. And I love the little tin that it comes in. And um, I like Bite Beauty. I'm really getting into more items um, from them just because I feel like the pigmentation is amazing. And I like the fact that just because it's a fresh product, it makes you want to use it up. Like if you get Bite Beauty, you know you have to use it up by a certain time. So I love that it puts me on a time crunch. If I'm gonna buy a lipstick, I better use it. Okay, so these two I've heard awesome reviews from Makeup by Tiffany D and I felt like I needed a deodorant and y'all when your body chemistry changes when your body chemistry changes yes so should your deodorant so I heard about the Donna Karen cashmere mist this smells really good it's like a fresh definitely smells cashmere-ish so if you like cashmere you're gonna like this it's like a fresh powdery cashmere but I heard that this is amazing so I wanted to try this this is the healthy 
This is by La Vanilla, by the way. This is the Sport Lux. This is the healthy deodorant. This is aluminum free. The other one is not, but this smells so good. And I've used this. This stuff works. Okay, the Sport one. I think I heard Jacqueline Hill talking about this too because she was trying to find an aluminum free. But both of these I have heard from Makeup Tiffany D by Tiffany D and I love these. Um, I have not tried these, I'm sorry. I love this one. I haven't tried this one yet. So I'll let you guys know if you want me to let you know about like different deodorants because really um i'm trying not to do aluminum but um finding one that really keeps you dry when you're an excessively sweaty person like me um it's hard so let me know if you have any suggestions too i feel like the sephora vib if you are into fragrance this is the time that you want to get it and i got jo malone okay i'm really excited about this because this came in a trio i was gonna get one by itself but i wanted to do this trio just because number one two of my girlfriends here on youtube have talked about this particular scent and it is the wood sage and sea salt cologne it smells so good um i have the english oak english oak and something else the english oak i can't I can't think of it, but that's the one I have, and it smells amazing. This one smells really, really good. I love it. Um, it's more of a, I say Jo Malone is pretty like um, universal, but this one is more springy to me. I have some more warm tones, but it's okay. Just because I got this body cream and I got this. Uh, this is the wood sage and sea salt hand and body wash so this is a body wash and it's super duper thick i think that these are going to be amazing for travel along with the other one that i have but this one i this is the reason why i really got this set was because this is english pear and freesia so you get to smell different ones and this one smells so good but this smells so spring okay so i love this is a body cream and it smells like it's gonna last forever so I wanted to smell this one, the English Pear and Freesia, which I'm probably going to get in the spring and summer. But I got this set because of that reason. Then I got three of these and 20% off. And I think this was 85. Was this 85? And then I got 20% off. So it's like if I paid for the cologne itself, I got this for it. And I just really like how it was wrapped too. But that's not the reason why I got it. But such a great gift for myself because <laughs> basically i did get this uh gift this to myself i had it i got it with a gift card so really happy about that so that is all that i got from the vib sale i did get a few things from ulta that i want to show you um i really have fallen in love with the dose of colors i realized that i really like dose of colors liquid lipsticks so i did pick up Two of their liquid lipsticks, I believe. No, three. I picked up Bear With Me, Supernatural, and Stone. I'm just about done with this. So this will probably go into a project pan. I like I'm seeing like when I start to see it scraped on the sides, that's when I know that I'm really using it. So that's probably dose of colors, liquid lipsticks are probably my favorite because I've never gone through a liquid lipstick, but I just wanted to show you these three. And I will swatch them for you, just so you see them. They're different shades, which, I mean, I'll, I'll swatch my old one. I'm not going to swatch the new of the stone. But I've noticed that I get this shade a lot. And so that is stone. It's super creamy. Like, so comfortable. Dose of Colors has some of the... Did I get on my lip? No. I'm wearing Minted, by the way. Minted in Mauve Over in a liquid lipstick. No, in a lip gloss form. Oh, this is so moussey. I love it. This is Super Natural, which is a natural. It's like a peach terracotta. I love that. Peach terracotta nude. Love it. I got, in because I'm like, when I say like a few days out, after I use it within this week, it'll be gone. And that is the Urban Decay Color Corrector Fluid, the Naked Skin one, and the shade Peach. I got it again, 
and this was I think 20% off when they had their 20% off like these I got 20% off so I got this just because I you know this is something that I feel like I need and I've learned that I like my color correctors to be in a wand or some type of applicator um, I'm not gonna get it in the pot anymore in the pot form and I think that is it that that's that's it you guys the only thing that I plan on getting from Sephora at the end of the year is when they give the 25% uh, gift card and I'm probably gonna splurge on maybe another perfume or um, I don't think that I'm gonna get a palette just because I have enough palettes uh, seriously I think it was something else I was thinking about getting I think YSL their blur primer or I might get a splurge and get a foundation. I don't know. Um, that's like with foundations on my weakness, y'all. But um, I'll probably get something like that. But a palette, I, if something, if it doesn't wow me, I'm not getting it. But um, yeah, definitely gonna use that $25 towards something. And that's it. And that's not even a haul. That's just gonna be like one or two items. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Um, yeah, my Sephora VIB and some other things from Ulta. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see beautiful you in the next video. Bye, loveys.